never let somebody tell you you can't do something. Not even me. All right? All right. You got a dream, you got to protect it. People can't do something themselves. They want to tell you you can't do it. You want something, go get it. Period. Our deepest fear is not that we are inadequate. Our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure. It is our light, not our darkness, that most frightens us. Your playing small does not serve the world. There is nothing enlightened about shrinking so that other people won't feel insecure around you. We were all meant to shine as children do. It's not just in some of us, it's in everyone. And as we let our own light shine, we unconsciously give other people permission to do the same as we are liberated from our own fear. Our presence automatically liberates others. What you doing here? Don't you have practice? Not anymore, I quit. Oh. Well, since when are you the quitting kind? I don't know, I just don't see the point anymore. So you didn't make the dress list. There are greater tragedies in the world. I wanted to run out of that tunnel for my dad. To prove to everyone prove that I worked... Prove what? That I was somebody. Oh, you are so full of crap. You're five feet enough. A hundred and enough. And you got hardly a speck of athletic ability. And you hung in with the best college football team in the land for two years. And you're also going to walk out of here with a degree from the University of Notre Dame. In this lifetime, you don't have to prove nothing to nobody except yourself. And after what you've gone through, if you haven't done that by now, it ain't gonna never happen. Now go on back. I'm sorry I never got you to see your first game in here. Hell, I've seen too many games in this stadium. I thought you said you never saw a I've game. I've never seen a game from the stands. You were a player? I rode the bench for two years. Thought I wasn't being played because of my color. I got filled up with a lot of attitude. So I quit. Still not a week goes by, I don't regret it. And I guarantee a week won't go by in your life. You won't regret walking out, letting them get the best of you. Do you hear me clear enough? gonna give me your best I'm gonna give you my best all right one more thing I want you to do it blindfolded why because I want you giving up at a certain point when you can go further get down Jeremy get on his back get a good tight hold Jeremy all right let's go Brock keep your knees off the ground just your hands and feet there you go a little bit left a little bit left there you go you get the 20. You give me your best. You keep going. That's it. No, don't stop, Brock. You got more in you than that. Hey, done. Just rest in a second. You got to keep moving. Let's keep moving. Let's go. Don't quit till you got nothing left. There you go. Keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving, Brock. That's it. You keep driving. Keep your knees off the ground. Keep driving it. Your very best. Your very best. Your very best. Keep moving, Brock. That's it. That's it. That's it. Keep going. Don't quit on me. Keep going. Keep driving it. Keep, dri keep your knees off the ground. That's it. Your very best. Don't quit on me. Your very best. Keep driving. Keep driving. There you go. There you go. That's it. You keep driving. Keep your knees off the ground. Keep driving it. Don't quit till you got nothing left. Keep moving, Brock. That's it. That's it. That's it. Keep going. I want everything you got. Come on. Keep going. It hurts. Don't quit on me. Your very best. Keep driving. Keep driving. There you go. There you go. He's heavy. I know I'm heavy. But I have strength. Then you negotiate with your body to find more strength. But don't you give up on me, Brock. You keep going. You hear me? You keep going. You're doing good. You keep going. Do not quit on me. You keep going. It hurts. I know it hurts. You keep going. You keep going. It's all hard from here. 30 more steps. You keep going, Brock. Come on. Keep going. Burn. And let it burn. It's all hard. You keep going, Brock. Come on. Come on. 
Keep going! You promised me your best! Your best! Don't stop! Keep going! Too hard! It's not too hard! You keep going! Come on, Brock! Give me more! Give me more! Keep going! 20 more steps! 20 more! Keep going, Brock! Give me your best! Don't quit! No! Keep going! Keep going! Keep going! Don't quit! Don't quit! Don't quit! Brock Kelly, you don't quit! Keep going! Keep going! No, Brock Kelly! You don't quit on me! No! You keep going! You keep going! No, Brock! Ten more steps! Ten more! Ten more! Ten more! Keep going! Don't quit! Give me your heart! You can! You can! Five more! Five more! Come on, Brock! Come on! Don't quit! Don't quit! Come on, Brock! Two more! One more! I can't even see the hell anymore. Look up, Brock. You're in the end zone. Mr. Holland had a profound influence on my life, on a lot of lives I know. And yet I get the feeling that he considers a great part of his own life misspent. Rumor had it he was always working on this symphony of his, and this was going to make him famous, rich, probably both. But Mr. Holland isn't rich, and he isn't famous, at least not outside of our little town. So it might be easy for him to think himself a failure. And he would be wrong, because I think he's achieved a success far beyond riches and fame. Look around you. There is not a life in this room that you have not touched. And each one of us is a better person because of you. We are your symphony, Mr. Holland. We are the melodies and the notes of your opus. And we are the music of your life. <laughs>